there, this is Coach Monica with Coach Monica's Morning Minute, and today I wanted to start a series of things that I like to eat or drink that are a little strange that maybe some people haven't heard about. Today we're going to be talking about water kefir. It's also pronounced as water kefir. You might have seen um, dairy kefir that's also sold in stores, but today we're going to be talking about water kefir and how I grow my own, I ferment my own at home. Okay, I was introduced uh, to water kefir about two years ago, and I have been drinking water kefir ever since. Not only myself, but my son and my toddler, and I introduced it to my husband too. The way I ferment this is it has a natural apple cider type of taste, but you can add other fruits into it, and it will taste just like that. It has a real high natural carbonation, so it gives you that soda fix that you're looking for. So, you might be thinking, where do I get water kefir? Like, where do I even start? The amazing thing is that it could be shared. Because it's a bacteria, it reproduces itself. So if you live by somebody, if you live by me, I have no problem sharing because that's how I was giving grains. But you can also order it on Amazon. You can Google water kefir, and there are so many different reliable sites that you can pay for your first batch of grains and start it yourself. It's super easy. I, for myself, I like to allow mine to ferment, ferment four to five days. Some people do it within 24 to 48 hours. I like it to go a little bit further because it gets more carbonation. Um, the amazing thing about water kefir is that it takes the grains, which are a natural bacteria, it takes the sugar and it turns it into fructose, which imparts the probiotic juice that I drink. So, these little grains right here are alive, okay? They sit in this jar and it produces my water kefir that we drink every day. I drink about 20 ounces of water kefir a day. My daughter, who is going to be three, she drinks about eight ounces and my son really loves it. He usually drinks anywhere from 20 to 40 ounces of water kefir a day. Again, it tastes just like apple juice. So they think, mm, this is super yummy, and I know that they're getting all their probiotics that they need. Okay, so what does probiotics do? Probiotics um, takes the intestinal flora that we have inside of our intestines, and it stabilizes them, okay? Which has been proven to metabolize food faster. So, there's research that shows that drinking water kefir or dairy kefir helps fight psoriasis, also helps with ulcers, has been proven to help with seasonal allergies, and clears up your skin. So this is awesome news, all right? I've known for myself that days that I don't drink my water kefir, I actually feel a little bit more sluggish. But having a consistent water kefir habit in my life, I've noticed that we don't get sick. No, I don't know what that's all about. There's not a lot of research that shows that it will keep you from getting sick, but I know that my intestines are happy, which obviously is making things work great. Um, it's important for you to know that because they will produce, they're alive. So it's like having a pet. So whenever you make the commitment to begin, you have to continue or else they will die, okay? They need to have their ongoing fresh water and sugar. Anyway, so some people might say, why do you care about this? Why do you care about what you're drinking? What's going on? This is kind of strange. But you know what? Let's hear about what the Word of God says. In 1 Corinthians 6, chapter, in 1 Corinthians 6, verses 19 through 20, it says, Do you not know that your body is a temple of the Holy Spirit? within you whom you have from God. You are not your own, for you were bought with a price, so glorify God in your body. Again, not only providing healthy meals for myself and my family, but I need to also be very aware of what they're drinking, okay? If my son likes to drink soda, then he will enjoy the carbonated drink that I'm providing, and it's giving him the probiotics in a natural way. And you can always get your probiotics in the grocery store um, in a pill form, but why not make it yourself? Again, this is Coach Monica, and I just wanted to share some crazy things that I like to eat and drink. Stay tuned for the next video. Have a good day.